I got a channeled message real quick, but I'll be back with a, um, a live later. This is a message, it's a channeled message for Divine Feminines from Divine Masculines, okay? But I'm going to start it off with a channeled message from the Most High first. So Divine Feminines, you need to know, okay? Most High is allowing you to know and or see through these cards, okay? Your intuition is correct, alright? Also, remember how we talked the other day about um, God handpicking someone, selecting someone for you, just like God chose you, right, Divine Feminine? So I'm looking at this Emperor card with what I'm saying is God choosing this chosen person for you. So in that instance, the, this is your Emperor, okay? So yes, Divine Masculines are being chosen. Now these, these chosen things are happening because there are divine things that are happening in the collective, okay? There are a lot of secrets that um, the Most High has been revealing to the Divine Masculines. The Divine Masculines are now being guided to use their intuition as well, Divine Feminine, okay? They want you to know they are done healing, okay? Your Divine Masculine is done healing. Three of Swords in reverse with the Four of Swords in reverse. He's done healing. Your Emperor is done healing. Your Emperor wants to move to calmer times. The Six of Swords. Okay? Now, a lot of you guys, Divine Feminines, there was a lot, like we talked about before, of manipulation going on. So God was working with your chosen person, right? On helping them to use their intuition, open up to their heart space, right? And enlighten themselves. On themselves and on you. On what you're going through. Okay, Divine Feminine? So what your Divine Masculine and what the Divine say is just be patient. Be patient with them, okay? Be patient with him. Eight of Wands, this is communication from your Masculine, all right? You will be receiving positive, you know, communication. You and your Masculine are in a state of being released from any toxic soul patterns, ties, debts, all right? And you are both about to be ready to take this leap of faith into this newness, okay? Because what you both want at this time is happiness, three of cups, and you shall have it, all right? Your divine masculine, okay? Divine feminine is manifesting you in, okay? He's manifesting you in. A lot of these masculines have gone through a transformation, and they are rising as well like the phoenix. They are releasing themselves, like I said, eight of swords in reverse. Divine masculines are being freed from any type of illusions, confusion, manipulation, and they are ready to stand in their strength to get the guidance that they've been receiving, right? To be powerful, yet soft with these roses when it comes to you, Divine Feminine, and they are ready to take that passionate new beginning with you. When? I see eight here, maybe by the end of August, maybe by the end of the year, but I keep hearing 2023 is going to be a good year, Divine Feminine. Just know that just as you've been manifesting in your person, you've been praying on those stars, you've been making those wishes, you've been praying for the healing for you and your person, 333, your emperor is being guided to you. He's being guided to you, and you need to know this and trust this. The connection that twins have is beautiful. Okay, and we're going to talk more about that connection in a little bit. But this is for a divine feminine who has been waiting on her masculine, and you need to know that he is being guided to you. You're wishing and praying, and I'm hearing he's on his way. All right? Yeah.